Hi, welcome to City Talk. I'm Amy Moore, Preservation Planner with the City of Columbia. And I'm Rachel Walling, Preservation Planner with the City of Columbia. And we are here to talk about National Preservation Month in the City of Columbia. National Historic Preservation Month was started in the 1970s by uh, the National Trust for Historic Preservation as a way to promote historic places. Um, and it's been going strong ever since. And throughout the country, we have lots of events planned nationally, um, but we also have some events planned here in Columbia as well. So our first event is an architectural scavenger hunt in the Main Street area. It's going to start May 1st, and it will run through the month, ending on May 31st. We're gonna test your knowledge of the history of Columbia and of architecture. Clues will be posted online and we'll have a drawing at the end of the month for three winners. So your clues are going to be pictures of architecture or architectural features of buildings in the Main Street area and we'll give you a little bit of history for each of the pictures to help you along. Our next month-long event is a City Hall exhibit. This is going to be a small exhibit um, in the lobby of City Hall. It's called A Recipe for a Plaster Flower. Uh, it's focusing on the salvaged plaster pieces from the recent uh, renovation of council chambers. So City Hall was built in 1875, so the plaster uh, repairs brought, brought those features back from 1875. Uh, the work was done by local master of plaster, and they provided a lot of the reconstructed pieces for us uh, for this exhibit. So at this exhibit, you'll be able to uh, see the plaster pieces and the molds as well as learn a little bit about the process of reconstructing ornamental plaster. So our next event is a hands-on workshop at Randolph Cemetery. This is going to take place on May 5th, which is a Saturday, from 9.30 through 12. This is a really important cemetery in Columbia. It was founded in 1871. Um, it has a lot of um, important Reconstruction era senators buried there, so it's a very important African American cemetery in Columbia. So participants in the exhibit are going to learn about proper ways to maintain and care for headstones and grave markers, and given that we have a lot of small cemeteries and tiny congregations, we know a lot of folks are doing their own work in their own cemeteries. So we want to give you a hand with that, and we'll give you techniques, proper ways to take care of those headstones and care for the cemetery generally, and we'll give you a chance to try those out for yourself. You do have to register online, so check our website for more information and to register. We're also excited to have a preservation bike ride this month. It'll be on Saturday, May 19th, starting at 9 a.m. Uh, we're going to have several stops along the way, including a stop on Main Street, a stop um, near Gervais Street, Bull Street Campus, kind of talk about the history of the area, some interesting facts, also get a little exercise along the way. The ride is free and open to the public, but we do ask that you register. So for more information, just look at our website and you can register that way. So our next event is going to be another scavenger hunt, but this one is in the Melrose neighborhood. Uh, Melrose. Historic Melrose is an architectural conservation district. It's a neighborhood from the turn of the 20th century. It's a wonderful, unique neighborhood in terms of its architecture. So we thought this would be a fun uh, event for a family and children. We're going to have clues starting at Melrose Park. Um, that's at the corner of Senate and Fairview. We're going to start at 1.30 on May 20th, which is a Sunday, and we'll go through till 3. At the end of the scavenger hunt, we're going to draw uh, three winners for prizes that day. Information about all of these events is available on our website, columbiasc.net. If you have any questions about any of these events, you can always email us at preservation at columbiasc.net. Thank you for joining us on City Talk today, and remember to come out and celebrate our city and its great history during the month of May. Check out our website for more information.